Hi, I'm TJ Eller, Design Engineer here at Team Associated, and I'm here today to talk to you about how to check the life of your clutch shoes using our Factory Team Clutch Gauge. It's a good idea to check the life of your clutch shoes every once in a while just to ensure proper performance from your engine, and so I'm going to show you how. So when we measure our, our clutch, we're going to measure from tip to tip of opposing shoes, and traditionally before we had the clutch gauge, we would take a pair of digital calipers and measure from one side to the other, and when the clutch is new, that works pretty good, but you don't really have to measure your clutch when it's brand new. When the clutch is worn, this becomes difficult to use digital calipers because the arms or the jaws of the digital caliper, they interfere with the pin on the next shoe. So instead of actually measuring the tip of the opposing shoes, I'm measuring from the tip of one and to the pin of the other. So it's not a very accurate measurement. So to remedy this, we came up with this tool. So if I were to check a brand new clutch, I'll slip it over the crankshaft, and you can see that the tool just rocks back and forth and doesn't actually slide over the shoes. And what this means is that the life of the clutch is still good. So if I go to a worn out clutch, which this one, this clutch probably has maybe three or four gallons on it, which is quite a bit, you can see that the shoe is pretty worn and the tool is actually just sliding over the over the shoe. It's a little more noticeable here on the aluminum one. These are a little more worn out. But the tool itself is just sliding over the, the top of the, the shoe itself. And so this is a pretty worn out clutch. And when the tool can spin this much and slips over the tool, it's time to replace your clutch shoes. And typically when you replace the shoes, you replace the springs as well. It's just always good to start with fresh shoes and fresh springs. Now that you have a better understanding of how to use the factory team clutch gauge, you can pick one up on teamassociated.com. It's part number 1555. Good luck, and until next time.